is uh, Mike Walsh, the principal of Baldwin Heights Elementary School in Greenville Public Schools. Well, what we have here today is our mini medical school program. And what we do is we partner with our local hospital, Spectrum Health United Memorial, and um, they send their surgical team over here to Baldwin Heights today. This patient can't see. Look it. He's got a mask on. So we're going to put an implant in. We're going to take, we're going to take a cataract out. And what they do is the surgical team works with our students on a hands-on project where they dive right into bodies that they have made in class. With an e -Hep install, fifth grade teacher at Baldwin Heights here at Greenville Public Schools. Down here we have surgery where the kids are performing six different surgeries on bodies that they made out of everyday materials like marshmallows and balloons and clay and jelly beans. And really a pacemaker is a very quick surgery. It doesn't take very long at all, maybe 10 to 15 minutes. Hi, I'm Steve Homich. A company name that I own is called Gray's Bone and Joint Models right here in Greenville. I am the president of the company. Cool. Bring it back. Bring it back. Whoa. That's the tip of our wire. You see the tip? Yeah. 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 Push it forward. That is awesome. Here we go. Bring it back. That is so cool. The kids can experience live ultrasound, and we've actually ultrasounded Mr. Walsh to see if he had a heart, and in fact he did. <laughs> You're seeing his heart actually function. That's his and heart. You see his valve this is the muscle of his heart. Squeezing that blood out of his heart. Brought some portable um, ultrasound machines so they can check out the blood flow. He also brought a variety of models for the kids to touch and play with. There's the heart, and the heart feels even different. Okay, just feel it there. And then they also get a chance to run through CPR. Uh, it's been an amazing day. These kids, uh, they work so hard on their presentations and then on the construction of the bodies here. The surgical staff has been amazing with their communication with the kids and patients through this. That's right. If the heart rate is super slow, we need to put a pacemaker in so we can increase that heart rate so we can make our patients feel better. I just wanted to, again, thank the hospital for their involvement and their willingness to sacrifice the time of their professionals. Without them, this process would not be successful. You know, it's, it's what makes Greenville so special. We bring people together. You know, these professionals, these kids, these teachers, the parents involved, they're all here for a common goal. And this is how invested everybody in this community is in the education of our kids. And we very much